robotics, that, um, that's exciting. I use the uh, robotic system because it really does facilitate a more efficient and more accurate surgical procedure. The preoperative planning allows me to understand the anatomy better. In the operating room, it's all under much more control. Most of the patients feel much better when they have uh, the idea that someone uses uh, some kind of guidance system. We did a retrospective analysis in 14 centers involving over 600 patients and uh, 3,000 screw placements, and the accuracy was 98%. For me, it was also the way to get into minimal invasive surgery with confidence. The patients benefited from lower pain level, from lower complication rate, from shorter lengths of stay, and generally a faster recuperation. My initial challenge really to the robot was to do better than I do by myself. We have over uh, 1,200 screws in 80 adolescents with scoliosis, and uh, we had a 99.9% .9 accuracy, so this is very accurate. I think the technology is incredible. It's uh, clearly state-of-the-art, uh, and if I were to need a Surgery, surgical procedure on my back, uh, I definitely would uh, want to find somebody capable of using the robot uh, to do my surgery. The short-term impact of spine assist to our practice really is around differentiating us from our competitors. Uh, adding spine assist to the program absolutely has driven incre incremental new cases to the practice. Well, I see it as a, as a expansion of our market expansion of our market share, expansion of our reputation, and expansion of the skills of our surgeons. New technology is revolutionizing back surgery. It's called the Spine Assist Robot, which makes for a more precise, less invasive procedure. Bethany says she'd become almost accustomed to her scoliosis, but x-rays show what a difference surgery has made. She says even her clothes fit better, and she can get back to just being a typical teen. They told me they were having like robots in there. I was like, cool, that's awesome. I do believe that history will repeat itself in the sense that where robotics has become a standard of care in other areas of medicine, it will as well in spine. And I visualize that after one or two years, people will only seek out organizations that have this type of robotic spine surgery for their care because it will become a standard of care in America. We would not have purchased this product if we had not believed that it was going to become part of what a surgeon has to offer his patients every day.